In lakes with lots of heavy cover like lily pads, coontail mats, or wild rice, few baits work as well as a frog for extracting big bass out of the junk. Why? Well, for one, you can cover lots of water. The bait skips over the thickest mats and you can pause it in open pockets without it sinking down in. The best frog baits are hollow body, with two hooks hugging each side pointing up, keeping it virtually weedless even if it lands on its back. The rubber legs give it lifelike action even during the pause. When the bass hit it, it collapses the body of the bait exposing the hooks to drive home. Which brings me to an important part of this tactic. This is not something you do with wimpy gear. This is thick cover, and when the bass strikes, you need the right stuff to set the hooks and power drive them up and out of there. My recommendation is a good size bait casting reel with a 7.3 gear ratio, spooled up with at least 65 pound braid on a seven to seven and a half foot heavy action rod. The hardest part of frog fishing is not setting the hook too fast. Oftentimes the bass explodes and they miss the bait. If you set the hook there, and then it just comes flying back at you. Whereas if you resist that temptation of pulling the bait away, they'll often take another shot at it. By waiting that half second until you feel the fish, you'll greatly increase the number of hookups.